Okay, just want to give you a feel for this place on 27th Street. Um, I'm on 27th and Davis, and so now I'm looking, uh, this would be kind of east down Davis Street. A lot of older houses that have been fixed up and are pretty nice. So this carport is part of this property, and then this is the unit that's on Davis Street, 2621 Davis. And then if I walk over here towards 27th Street, um, which it's a relatively busy street, uh, but here's State Street is just a block away looking north, and there's some smaller houses right across the street, and then uh, this is the unit facing 27th. So I'm just gonna walk around real quick to give you a feel for the property itself. Um, this is the main entrance right here. And then if I come around over here on the right side, just a little walkway, and there's a little grass strip back here, not really much of like a backyard or a patio to speak of, but this is the back side of that carport. Um, there's a little storage shed here, and then there's an entrance to this basement area right here. So you could theoretically come off of Davis Street right here and then come down these stairs. Um, and there's two doors. So this door, it looks like there's a laundry room in there. I'm guessing that's the laundry for the upstairs unit. And then this door walks into a laundry for the, the downstairs unit. So we'll come at that from the other side. Um, and then just for your reference, there are two separate power meters here. So uh, that basement unit, um, it would be a challenge to, to make it into a separate unit, but I wouldn't say it's impossible. So that being said, I don't think there's any gas here. I didn't see a meter and it looks like there's baseboard heat in most of these rooms. So uh, I, anyhow, like, so there's baseboard heat here and a little sitting area by the front window. But just to give you a feel, you walk in and I'm right in the living room and this room is probably about 15 feet uh, to that back wall and about 10 feet from left to right. Um, cozy little living room, but and then immediately to the left is a kitchen. They have a little dining nook there. It's tight, but you have a little galley kitchen here. And from this window, this table that I'm at to the end, that this room is probably about 10 to 12 feet, something like that. So pretty basic kitchen. This is all the counter space right here. If you walk straight through, uh, there's a little walkway that circles back to the back end of that living room. And then just past there is the bedroom. Decent sized bedroom for an older house. It's probably 12 by 12 feet, something like that. Got a little closet here. Goes back quite a ways. It's about six by two feet probably. And then um, the bathroom is right here. So it looks like you, you got a window in your tub, but it's just got a basic uh, like a fiberglass sheet surround. So this is just basic fiberglass sheets and uh, that's pretty much it. The floor here is a laminate and you've got a little two foot vanity there. So coming back out here, obviously I'm looking towards the kitchen, but there's this door here and this is the stairway to the basement. So I head down the stairs, the ceiling gets a little bit low there. It's only about five and a half feet at that spot. So I get to the bottom of the stairs and this is, it's kind of like a studio unit, but there's the challenge is there's no bathroom or kitchen down here. So you've got a big, like a big family room set up and they have it set up like a, a studio, but there's a bed back there, but there's no egress windows. So I just want to note that. Um, this is a long, narrow room. So from left to right here, it's probably about 10 feet. Uh, you've got your main sewer clean out. So you've got plumbing below grade, theoretically. Um, and then they've got this stage really nicely for what it is, just kind of like a common area. There's a closet over here. And then there's the staircase that I came up. But if I turn right to the right here, there's a laundry setup. So you've got plumbing and laundry in here. And this space is probably about nine feet by 15 feet. And so if you could configure a bathroom, a kitchen in here, 
And you could make this a separate unit. Uh, it would take a little bit of effort for sure. But again, you've got a, a floor drain here. So you do have plumbing below grade. Um, uh, electric water heater there. Uh, so yeah, I mean, there's a possibility. They got all the wiring and everything up. But you, again, these units, from what I could see outside, don't have separate uh, metering on the electricity. So that may or may not be that big of a deal. But anyhow... That is the place. Um, obviously, there's another unit upstairs that I can't get into, but this is what's vacant and, and available to see right now.